What's up guys, welcome back to TZ's Top 5, the show where we help you make that all-important buying decision. Today, we're gonna to be taking a look at our top five picks for the best upcoming tech of June 2021. As always, make sure you're subscribed and you ding that notification bell to stay up to date with all the latest from us here at TZ's Top 5. Let's get on with it, shall we? Now, first up is one that I've personally been looking forward to hearing about for a very, very long time. And that is a Sony WF-1000XM4s, the successor to the ever so popular XM3s, which came out a couple of years ago. There's not much info on specs as of yet, but some leaked images have surfaced showing some obvious, yet very welcomed in my opinion, design changes. Release date is expected to be early June 2021. They may even be out by the time this video gets released. No news on the price as of yet, but I expect to see them fall between the 200 to 250 pound price bracket. And it certainly wouldn't surprise me if we saw them getting closer to the 300 pound mark. Very excited for these new wireless earphones from Sony. The XM3s were very renowned for their active noise cancelling, so I'm hoping that Sony are gonna build even more on that. Next up on the list is the LG GP950, a 4K gaming monitor which should have been released just before this video comes out. Like its predecessor, the GN950, which was a very popular gaming monitor, it's going to be coming in at around £750 again. The main difference between the two being that all-important HDMI 2.1, something that's very important for all those next-gen console gamers. So it's going to be perfect for your new Xbox and your PS5. It's going to feature a 144Hz refresh rate, overclockable up to 160Hz, and a 1 millisecond grey to grey response time. Definitely one to keep an eye on, and personally I think it's going to be one of the best gaming monitors of 2021. Now in at number 3 is the Google Pixel 5a 5G, which to be honest surprised me and many others when leaked images dropped online from a pretty reliable source. Now the Google Pixel 4a was notoriously well balanced in terms of value for money and performance. And I expect the 5a 5G to be no different. Google themselves have confirmed it is on its way and it's speculated that the release date will be around June 11th. Again, as always, please do take that with a pinch of salt. Other than that though, there isn't really much information, but it's definitely a phone to look out for, especially if you're on a budget. In at number four is the Huawei Watch 3. Rumored for a release date sometime in June. Personally, despite all the problems with Huawei over the past few years, I'm actually quite excited for it. Traditionally, Huawei have bought out some killer smartwatches in the past. This one is allegedly going to be running on its own Harmony OS, which will apparently look significantly different to the OS on the current smartwatches. There's also rumored eSIM support and design is going to be very similar to the Galaxy Watch 3. I anticipate the price will be coming in at around £250 and possibly go all the way up to £300 to £350 with the eSIM support. But take that with a pinch of salt, that is just a pure guess. Lastly, in at number five is the Apple AirPods 2021 edition. Now, initially they were poised for a release date of the 23rd of March, 2021. Then it went to April, and now people are speculating they're gonna come out sometime June this year. Other than a new speculated release date, there's not much more info out there. Apart from some people saying that we could expect to see several new color options this year and a slightly updated design, which to be honest, with it being Apple, I wouldn't expect anything too drastic. Still though, exciting news. So that's it for today, guys. That was our quick upcoming tech of June 2021. As always, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next one. Also, please do consider joining our Discord channel to get involved with the community. And hopefully, we'll see you in the next one.